hey guys steven here from 101 designs today we're going to be creating this mini yoga poster on photoshop so first of all we're going to start by creating a frame size so the frame size i usually use for posters like this i do two um i do 2400 by 3000 pixels then i set my my resolution to three 300 um color mode rgb and then i create yeah there you go so um to start off with this i'm going to place my picture here though i could just drag the picture and um put it here but i'm not going to do that i'm going to place it on this frame i could just open the picture but i'm going to place it on this frame normally so let's go find my picture i think here yeah so i bring this right here then i'm going to adjust it so it will fit to this frame you can see now it doesn't fit to this frame it doesn't fit properly so press ctrl t to highlight and then i'll put in a way that it fits to the frame and have the features still revealed so just like this i think this is fine yeah because if i if i'm going to drag it down here the shoe is going to go go out of the frame so i'll leave it like this yeah so what i'm going to do come down to your layer panel duplicate this this um this layer by pressing ctrl j ctrl j duplicate then i'm going to let me just say i rasterize this and i want to i want to um what i'm gonna do i'm gonna crop give a, um crop out this picture like take out um the the, the this her image from the first layer so we just do select subject We'll wait for it to highlight the picture yeah so what we're gonna do we're gonna zoom in closer to make sure we have um all the edges selected properly so what we do come here i'll use my quick selection tool right here to adjust all the areas that i feel that it did not highlight very well so i'll go over the picture yeah let's zoom closer yeah i'm oh, sorry i'm going to do minus yeah then we move right here then select this part as well yo So to, to to deselect some parts, you need to press minus. So the areas where you that you want to be visible, you can just leave it. See, you see this plus plus icon inside this um, round shape is for adding adding up the areas that you want to be visible. So for the areas you don't want to be visible, you need to use minus. Like here now, if you zoom closer, I don't want this area here to be visible. So I'll hold Alt. You hold all to change the key to minus key then you drag so anyway so yeah so what we're gonna do like this now is to do a layer mask you click on the layer max this layer max um option down here you click on it you give it a layer so if you turn off these are two two layers are the same meanwhile this one you see this one is it doesn't have a background while this one has so what we just want to do is to have a text placed on these areas of of her her body so I'm gonna look for the text we're gonna use so let's see I'm typing yoga so I'm gonna space space it down so 
it won't be on the same line so i want this yoga to be here i think like this because i want her hand passing in between this one like this and then this one having some part of it on her body i think that should work yeah So we'll just find a way to fit this. Let, let me see if I can increase the size a bit. The size of it. 90, let's say 93. I just need it to go 94 for example. I need to go up a bit. So yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So fit it. Let me try to align it to the middle to see if that. No, this is not going to give me what I want. So I will just fit it to my own. Hold on. Sorry. Let's fit it to my own specific area I want it to be. So yeah, I think this area is, is okay like this. Let me zoom closer to see. Yeah, this area is fine for me. This is okay. So yeah, the color of the, f uh, the text. Yeah, let's see if we can have something a little bit different. No, 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 something bright. Yeah. I think this is okay. Yeah, this is fine. So, I want to. I want to take. I'll take this. This text. This yoga text. I'll take it behind her. Like this see i'll take it behind her then for me while if we let's just go for that there's something I'm, something else i'm going to explain if i find that error there then i'll correct it but um so i would so now what we'll do you come to this inverted layer max on her on this layer the first layer here you hold control and then you click it to to select her body yeah so okay before you do that press ctrl d to deselect before you do that I duplicate this yoga layer ctrl j then you turn off one you turn off the below one then you convert this to yeah yeah no you can rasterize this no no actually you rasterize type yeah yeah so what we're gonna do now we are going to um we're going to come to this layer and do uh i'm going to highlight it and then we go to the eraser tool and then we'll clean out this area of the text so what, what it does what it does any area outside of her body is not going to clean once you use this so you see all these areas they're not cleaning nothing is cleaning but any area in between this her body is going to clean so i don't want to clean this area i don't want to clean this other part like this you see i want the text looking like this then let me see let me see let me see i want this area of the text of the yoga text coming on top of her leg i also want this part of the g on top of her leg as well so I guess you see what I'm doing here. I want, let me see if I can do this A on top of her body. No, let the A be behind. Then this part of the G should be on top of here as well. So let me see what that will look like. So the G body back, yeah. So I think this, this works fine. You see it's like it's, kind of um tangled up in her in her body like that and i said to do this side but it's not going to make any sense so i'm going to cover her face so i think this is okay this is fine you press ctrl d to deselect so if you come if you zoom closer you see that her body has this there's this line which is from the first picture that we cropped so what you want to do is come to this layer max um little box beside this layer max box you, you you make sure that your your selection is on that layer max this one here then you come to filter you go to others then you minimize 
so you can set this figure to either one or two so i'm going to set mine to let me just say one you see those lines have disappeared they were on other part of her body but they are no more there again so i just kind of cleaned it up so yeah so this is um basically the picture then i want to do i want to add like um kind of a color on top i don't want to just leave it like this so um i'll create a new layer new layer so um i'll go to the gradient um from this blues gradient here you can select anyone so i'm just going to pick this one then from the gradient i just drag yeah so it drags up then um then your layer stars you can set your layer stars to anyone that suits i think this nice was kind of dark this two okay so you can just scroll down take your time scroll down to see which one works fine so a lot of them here a couple of them here are good but i think i like this one more this is okay too but i think this one kind of give it that blue kind of rays and blue feel like that so you see this one is okay for me yeah so another thing i can do here is to come to the text this other text that we toggled off toggling on then I'll just create like an outline, an outline text. Maybe just drag it, place it somewhere for anything. I'm just trying something different. So I've already dropped down the fill here. Add stroke, stroke color. So stroke color is the same color we pick. And then press Ctrl C so you can be able to highlight it and then you can move it. You can do maybe you can actually do something something else maybe it's like this uh something that I might not work I don't really want to complicate the design so Well, let me try out something here. Placing it like this. Okay, no need to stress too much. You can just leave it like this. So just maybe having this highlights going. Or we can also come to this layer and see if maybe we can double this stuff to white and see if we can clean it or oh, it's not working fine so you know what the highlights we're just going to take it out so we just move it to somewhere else this highlights um outline sorry i say highlight the outline layer we're just going to maybe place it somewhere here oh does it like this yeah like this is fine so and also control j sorry control j and maybe oh, oh shit control j and then you move it maybe here something like this i think this is just just going to complicate the design so i'm going to delete this one just leave the other yoga the other yoga stuff there So we don't have this and then this is fine so this is basically what i wanted to do so we can still do shift ctrl alt e just to create a flatten layer and probably add some maybe add sharpen some sharpen effects or maybe some greens to it i just like doing something like that on my designs sometimes so let's see effects these are greens just add a little bit greens there then come to this side no, no no not this one color mixer no 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 come to details details you add sharpen a little bit high 
think the grains are much the grains is much so drop it down a bit then save i think we're good to go like this so um anyways thank you for watching this is how you can do a mini flyer um on photoshop thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe to my channel and stay tuned because i'm going to be post posting more tutorials like this more um tutorials on photoshop on adobe illustrator and probably after effects so stay tuned subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed thank you for watching peace out